hello and welcome back to another video and in this one we are gonna play a game where i'll probably be pretty bad <laughs> i imagine we're gonna listen to some languages and just based on how they sound we'll well i'll try to guess where where they are from where where do they speak this language so the link if you want to play it as well um will be in the description i imagine you'll probably be getting different uh audio clips but i think it's a it's a Cool concept. I think we've done something similar in the past on different websites. But uh, let's see. Let's see. What do we hear? What do we... How do we do? Let's see. oameni care nu aveau măcar o medie, nu vorbim de minimă, o medie pregătire intelectuală, dacă nu cumva o pregătire intelectuală foarte bună. Și putem lua lista de intelectuali din anii 30-40 să ne uităm la ei să comparăm cu ceea ce avem astăzi. Oh, ok. Oh, well, um... As I expected, I have no clue really. For some reason it sounded maybe European to me. I was thinking, could this be I don't know, Romanian, Serbian, something something in this area? Maybe. But my confidence level is very low. Let's see. I'll take it. It was Romanian. Okay. Apparently it's me medium difficulty. Well, I, I thought it was hard. যেখানে মানুষজন কয়েকটি লাইট পাওয়ার জন্য জেলে যাওয়ার জন্য প্রস্তুত তো আমরা কি বা করছি তো আমাদের রিকোয়েস্ট ভিডিওটি ভালো লাগলে অবশ্যই আপনিও একটি লাইক করে দেন অবশ্যই এমন আরো অসাধারণ ভিডিও দেখতে আমাদের চ্যানেলটিকে অবশ্যই সাবস্ক্রাইব করে ফেলুন সাবস্ক্রাইব আই আন্ডারস্টুড সাবস্ক্রাইব সাবস্ক্রাইব ইফ ইউ হ্যাভেন্ট প্রেস দ্যাট লাইক বাটন অ্যাজ ওয়েল আ ইয়া ইট রিয়েলি হেল্পস হেল্পস দ্য ভিডিও এন্ড চ্যানেল আ সো I don't know, it, I, this one sounded more Asian to me. I was thinking maybe India, uh, maybe, I don't know, Bangladesh, I don't know. Some Something in this area, I was thinking, maybe, could this be Indonesia? I'm not sure. But my, my first thought was India, so I think that's what I'm gonna go with. Just Just the sound of it, it's all Bengali. It was Bangladesh. Okay, I did mention Bangladesh. I did mention Bangladesh. Uh, 33 points. I didn't see how many points. Oh, I got 100 points for the previous one. Okay, fair enough. Uh, I'm not sure if it matters if I place the pin like in the middle of India or if I place it here. Does, does it matter? I'm not sure how they calculate the distance. No clue. Anyways, now location number three, like audio clip number three. Ogbosa, nanin kamot kita sa pagtahod nila, pinagi sa pagpakabuhi, sumala sa ilang kabilin. Samtang ato kining buhaton, panghinaot kita nga sa umaabot, makatang, kahatag kita sa mga abaga, din ang sunod nga hinerasyon hmm. sa langdong mga tao. This one sounded more African to me. I don't know, like, I wish I could explain my thought process more, <laughs> but I'm just going with, with how it sounds. Uh, but yeah, you can you can think along. What where, where would you think? Where would you guess? Let me know in the comments. Um, how good are you at this? Because I think I'm not very good. This sounds kind of African. No clue which country though. Let's go with I don't know Ethiopia. It was the Philippines. Cebuana. Oh, okay. I was super wrong on this one. Yeah. Not good. This one's kind of getting me, giving me Middle East vibes with that sound. I don't know, maybe I'm wrong, but that's what I was thinking there. Something like, I don't know, Iraq, Iran, something in that area. Maybe, maybe. Oh, it was Hebrew. Oh, okay, I was, I was off. Not too far. Kind of, kind of the same area, but but um, wrong with the language. Okay, and the uh, fifth one, I think there are only five rounds per game. Sounds Asian for sure. Could it be Vietnamese? Maybe. Didn't sound entirely Chinese, maybe Vietnamese, maybe, maybe, let's see if it is. Oh, it was Thai. Again, kind of in the right vicinity, but with wrong language. 201 points, 201 points, not too bad, not too bad. Oh, let's do another game, let's do another game, this was quite, quite quick. Let's listen to one more. 
That sounds French to me. <laughs> that sounds very French to me. I wonder what happens with the with the with the languages that are spoken in multiple countries. How do they calculate the points? So I'm not sure because they speak French in France, of course. They speak French in like Cote d'Ivoire, I think. I think a couple of more countries. So I don't know how, how they calculate the points. It is France, yeah. Language spoken is Breton. Breton? Wait, what? Breton is a southwestern Britonic language in the Celtic language group spoken in Brittany. Interesting. Huh. I yeah, I thought it was just, just French. Los reinos mayas vivían en perpetua competencia. Ooh, that sounds Spanish. Un estado en guerra permanente. En Tikal, un nuevo rey recuperó la hegemonía de su ciudad, obteniendo nuevas riquezas y un orgullo renovado. Él dirigió la batalla contra Calakmul y esta vez se alzó con la victoria. That sounds very Spanish to me. I'm thinking could this be like something like Catalan maybe, but I'm not sure. I would go Spanish. I would guess Spanish. I wonder if probably there's Latvian in this game as well. Well, I'll probably not get it in this video, but... Okay, it was just Spanish yeah, spoken in many, many different language uh, countries. Next. Only four seconds of this one. I'm not sure, I'm getting kind of maybe African Middle Eastern vibes here again. I kind of want to guess Ethiopia again. I'm not sure. Let's see. Oh, it was Arabic. Oh, I, I almost went with Egypt, actually. I almost went with Egypt. W would, have, would have been the right guess. Distance to Egypt. I guess it counts the distance to the closest correct country. So I get 17 points for this one. Hmm, okay. Okay, next. <laughs> I have absolutely no idea, I'll be honest with you. <laughs> I'm thinking maybe something in Asia, maybe, maybe something like India, one of the e languages spoken in India, maybe one of the ones in Indonesia. I know there are a bunch of different languages there as well. Let's go maybe with Indonesia and see. It was Pakistan. Ah, India would have been a much closer guess. Sindhi. Damn, some of these languages are really tricky. <laughs> really tricky. Inden du skal svare på spørgsmål, vil dommeren fortælle, at alle vidner har pligt til at svare så godt som muligt på de spørgsmål, de bliver stillet. Så vil jeg sige til dig, at du møder her i retten som vidne. I'm confused. I'm confused on this one. Inden du skal svare på spørgsmål, vil dommeren fortælle, at alle vidner har pligt til at svare så godt som muligt på de spørgsmål, de bliver stillet. Så vil jeg sige til dig, at du møder her i retten som vidne. I don't think it sounds... I don't think it's Swedish, but it kind of reminds me a little bit of Swedish. I don't know, could it be like Norwegian or something? Or maybe like Sami? Like the Sami language they speak in like northern region. Maybe? I don't know. I don't know. Let's go, like, let's see. A Danish. Ah, I mean, that explains it. It's, so it was, it was Nordic, just, just the wrong country. Mm, okay, I'll take it, I'll take it. Because it, like, it sounded a little bit Swedish, but not entirely. 240 points, a little bit better than in the first game. Third time the charm. Let's let's do another one, a quick one. Bakal nila sa amat amat ng pamaafi. So ang ako nga mga obligasyones bilang district coordinator on housing concerns, unagid nga gin assign sa aton congressman nga aton hibaloon. Hmm. Bakal nila sa amat amat ng pamaafi. So ang ako nga mga obligasyones bilang district coordinator on housing concerns. I'm not sure if this feels more African or Asian to me. Hmm. I'm not sure. Let's go Ethiopia again. <laughs> I, I don't know. Let's see. It was Philippines. Ware. I'll be honest, I haven't heard of this language before. Ware. Ware is an Austronesian language and the fifth most spoken native regional language in the Philippines. Apparently 3.6 million native speakers, so quite a lot. Hmm. Okay, this is a very short clip. 
I have no clue. I'm so confused. Like, at this point, it all starts sounding the same to me. Again, I'm not sure if it's African or Asian. Uh, let's go Indonesia, maybe. Oh no, let's let's say one of those languages. I this time it was Africa. God. Swahili it was. Talking in Kenya, Rwanda, Tanzania, and Uganda. Okay. Hmm. Could it be like Iran or something? Persian, maybe? No idea. Um, let's see. Well, it was Welsh. Okay, I was way off on this one. I had no clue. I had no clue it was Welsh. <laughs> India, maybe? Mm, I'm not sure, like... It felt kind of mi- I don't know. Some- some parts sounded maybe a little bit Chinese, but some parts felt more Indian? I don't know. What- 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 what can I take of that? Let's go India. It was Parag- Gur Guarani. 6.5 million native speakers, so... Quite a lot as well. The ANC Jeugligheid begin onderzoek in stel, nadat hulle klachte stel oor ontvang het. I have no idea. Is that like Welsh again or something? Or Irish? No. Yes? No. I have no idea. Africa. It was Afrikaans. Okay. <laughs> Zero points. Well, what we learned in this video, well, it's no surprise that I suck at recognizing languages from listening to them. But uh, let me know in the comments how you did if you tried this game as well. And don't forget to press that like button and subscribe. On the right side, there will be another video where I try to recognize some more languages. Huge thanks to all of my patrons and YouTube members for supporting this channel and making it all possible. If you want to become a YouTube member or patron yourself and unlock some cool exclusive videos and other benefits, click those links in the description. I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your day. Be kind to one another and see you all in the next video.